If your home security system is cell based, your alarm may not be monitored anymore. When Northeast Harris County woman found out the hard way that she'd been paying for service she wasn't getting. So she called Amy Davis when the alarm company told her it would cost more than $4,000 to get the system working again. Amy, good morning. Yeah, good morning. I mean, we wanted to tell you this story because it could easily happen to anybody who pays for alarm service. Pam Reynolds has been with ADT for more than 20 years and she's purchased a ton of equipment during that time, but now she says ADT tells her none of it is compatible with its systems. Pam Reynolds is safety minded. She locks her doors and sets her security alarm every night. When I go to bed, I want to know Okay, you can go to bed, you're protected. But one morning in June, when she stepped outside on, baby. to feed her furry Come friends, on. she forgot to disable the alarm. And anytime the alarm goes off, ADT always would boom call. Is everything okay? But not this time. No one called. And when Pam called ADT to find out why... You're not being monitored. Go to your keypad and punch this code in, which I did. And it said no cellular service, not monitored, not monitored. Even though Pam was paid up, she pays some $260 every month. Very angry to be paying for a service you're not even getting mm -hmm. and to not be notified you're not being monitored. Uh, that should have been a priority to me. But it was about to get much worse. Pam said ADT told her that when the 3G network shut down, her system could no longer communicate with ADT. Pam says she had ordered a device, what's called a cell bridge, offered to her from ADT back in February. But she was still waiting on that equipment. Now, ADT says those bridges are no longer available in her area. But the company is happy to update her system. To get me monitored again, I have to buy all new equipment, all new cameras. New cameras, new sensors, new keypads. ADT sent Pam a quote for all of it. Over $4,000. All at once? All at once. No payment plan. All at once. $4,023 to replace the equipment Pam already purchased from ADT. Equipment that came with a warranty. It said that they would service, repair, or replace. That's their warranty. And they said that they don't have to do that because this is a national event, so their warranty doesn't apply. The national event ADT is referring to is the sunsetting of the 3G network. The networks are owned and controlled by cell providers and therefore out of ADT's control. I would like somebody to at least appreciate that I've been a loyal customer, give me some sort of a discount or work with me. I'm not asking for anything that I don't have and already paid for. When we reached out to ADT, someone from the corporate office did call Pam. They have now offered to upgrade her equipment for about $1,600, and they're letting Pam break that up into monthly payments. If you have a home alarm system that's supposed to be monitored, you should test it at least every six months by setting it off, letting it sound for at least 30 to 45 seconds to see if that alarm company calls you back. Right, because if they're not monitoring it, I guess nobody what's is. What's the point? Exactly. Yeah. I mean, and so they did refund her the $260 for the months that she discovered that they weren't charging her. But what we found in these cases with services tied to that whole 3G network is it seems like the companies have no way to know if your equipment is not compatible. It's it's kind of an odd thing because we did another story earlier where somebody's service wasn't being monitored and they were still getting that bill. So it's up to the, really the, so consumer the consumer in that case. Responsibility. Yeah. Well, wow. at least you're your own. Well, lucky for us, we've got kids and dogs tripping the alarm. So, right. you know, yeah, we test <laughs> so it you out. Always make know. sure it works. Yeah, yeah. You get those phone calls. Thank you, Amy.